Are you looking for serious, deep Bible study, intense prayer, vibrant worship, and boldness in sharing Christ with others? Are you ready for your relationship with Christ to advance to the next level? These young people are. Generation of Youth for Christ, formerly known as the General Youth Conference, is a movement started by young people for young people. The goal of this army of youth is to take the three angels' messages to the whole world in this generation. I just left the conference inside there and to see these thousands from all over the place, including the internationals, was just overwhelming. And anywhere there's young people, I want to be there because you know something good is happening with our young people now in this church. There are many young people who really are looking to be activated for God and uh, there are many kin minds that want to get together to do that, to press before the throne of grace. What, what is it that God wants me to do? In the last three years before this one, or the last four years, it has increased and, and uh, it is real, it is genuine. And uh, young people detect what is genuine. And this is genuine. And so they say, I want to be a part of this. At GYC, you will experience first-hand training and preaching by some of the most dedicated, spirit-led teachers and leaders of the Seventh-day Adventist Church. Connect with youth and ministries from all over the world and participate in outreach which will prepare you to share Jesus at home or abroad. I think GYC has captivated and captured the essence of what we are and what we want to be as, as Seventh-day Adventist Christians. And I think young people are searching and looking for something to live for, something to really dedicate their lives to and really uh, be the servants that God is calling them to be. And I, I think GYC in its, in its values that, and, and its Bible-based, spirit of prophecy-based commitment, um, young people are wanting that today. And I think that's what's drawing the crowds from all over the world to come to these kinds of events. Uh, during their vacation time, during a time when they could be with family and friends and celebrating Christmas and the New Year's. They want to be fortified in the Word of God. And so I was really excited by the theme this year, by every word. I think they want to live for that and find that meaning for their own lives. The th thing I appreciate the most about coming to GYC is just, it's partially the atmosphere and the, the biblically based truths that they present. And there's so many different things that you can learn being here through the workshops, the plenary sessions, all the different things that it's almost overwhelming, but in a really amazing way. You know, the, uh, one of the powerful things that has really impacted me is the way that people have gone back to their homes and they've decided that, you know, I'm not gonna live my life the same way um, as I did, you know, before. And that's kind of my, the challenge that I'm just taking from this GYC. Um, to go back home and to not live the same way that I lived my life before, but to really um, be more active in sharing the gospel and um, being involved in my church and um, my community. You know, last year at GYC, I remember talking with a young man from Australia, ran into him in the hotel and GYC was over and I asked him how he found it and he says, you know, he became very serious. He says, the, the one thing that, that I really and praying about right now is that I don't lose the spirit and the commitment that I felt here this weekend. I want to take that back to Australia with me and to me that's so exciting to see that young people getting involved in that kind of thing and, and, and wanting to take that back to the places that they're coming from. There are a lot of people younger than me, a lot of people smaller than me who are doing phenomenal things for Jesus Christ. And come to this GYC has shown me that I can do so much more for the Lord. And I, there's some Bible studies I need to start doing, some family members I need to talk to, and I just need to take it back to my college campus. The GYC to me is the beginnings of a marvelous, biblical, last day upswelling of primitive godliness amongst the young people in the Seventh-day Adventist Church. I believe it is in a very real way, and I'm not just saying that, that's not just words coming out of my mouth. I believe that it is in fact the beginning of the end. I believe it has that kind of potential. Now, whether or not it realizes that potential is entirely up to us, but I believe that potential is there. God has injected that kind of potential into the GYC, and so I think, literally, it is the beginning of the end, this sort of primitive upswelling, this godliness that God is calling His church to. B is the theme for Generation of Youth for Christ 2007 in Minneapolis, Minnesota. As Seventh-day Adventist young people, we must move beyond theory and sermonizing 
and experience the beautiful reality of what it means to be transformed by the renewing of your mind. Learn how to truly be a Christian, along with thousands of other young people at GYC 2007 in Minneapolis, Minnesota, December 19 to 23. It's hard to put into words, but GYC is not just a conference. It's a, it's a life-changing experience that you want to share with others. For instance, like this year, I just didn't bring myself. I brought my sister. I brought my two good friends from school. Um, I have people from my home church coming for that whole entire Sabbath. There's nothing like this anywhere else where you get like young people who created this conference or this movement for other young people. When, when you come here, it's, it's people like us who are doing the interviewing, doing the registration. And what you get here, it's like the word. This is such an incredible experience. I would do it time and time and over again. I would start planning to save, sell books, literature evangelism, do whatever you can, ask for donations, because this is something that I think is going to be changing the world. For more information and to register, visit www.gycweb.org.